Most cars guzzle high-priced gasoline and pollute the air, not to mention the noise they make. But Mick McGuire's electric Beetle glides down the road almost silently and doesn't use a drop of gas. I think a lot of people are really tired of putting $3 a gallon of gasoline into their car. The pastor of Grace United Methodist Church in Emporia, Kansas, McGuire spent about $6,000 converting a rusty used car to run on 72 volts of electricity. He was motivated by the war in Iraq. We really do need to get away from our dependence on foreign oil. The electric Beetle's top speed is more than 50 miles an hour, and it travels up to 30 miles between charges. I'm spending probably three to six cents per mile. McGuire's environmental example inspires other church members. Melinda Groves now uses fluorescent light bulbs and bought a lawnmower that doesn't pollute. If a bunch of individuals do something, we can make a difference. Lola Collins wants to get rid of foam plates and cups in the kitchen to keep from clogging up landfills. I think we want to leave it uh, for our future generations so that they won't wonder, Mama, Mama, what's a tree? The church also recycles printer cartridges. Even the exit signs save energy by using LED lights. Tony Tollett helped McGuire with electrifying the car. We're just choking ourselves to death. We're killing the environment and everything else. McGuire says his bright yellow beetle is more than a money saver. It's a symbol. I don't think that this will be the answer to end all of our pollution problems. I just think it is one way in which I personally can be more responsible about taking care of the planet.